Hey guys, welcome back to JS Lovers YouTube channel. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'm Neha, I'm the organizer of JS Lovers. I will be dropping relevant links to the community below this video so that you can explore them later on. In last video, I showed you an example of map. In today's video, I'm going to talk a bit more about map. Map is a method associated with functional programming and functional programming nowadays is very much in trend. This is not something new. We as a developers in JavaScript were doing functional programming in our programs, but we never knew that it is known as functional programming. So why this is catching the trend is because of the ES6. Now ES6 is majorly supported by most of the browser and the main funder of ES6 is writing the less code and doing the more, writing more maintainable code and more structured in a more structured way. And functional programming also get aligned with the same vision. So when ES6 and the functional programming come together, they actually give you a more easy way to write your code and in a less way. And map is one of the way, one of the method associated with that. So let me show you that how you can use map. For that, first I have to create an array. If you doesn't know how what is array and how to create it, please go back to my previous video where I actually showed you by examples that how you can work with arrays. Okay, so what I will do is first I will create my array with a name number and I will add some value in it. Now I will use my map function. The syntax of map function looks like this. And I will console the what I want to do is I want whenever an element comes, it should multiply it by two. And here you go. I got the new values every time uh, the map function is mapping to my array. Three is in getting multiplied by two, then four, then five, and my new values are coming. The most important property of map is it actually give you result in a new array. So if there are any use case where you want to create a new array out of an old array, you can use the map function and it is very easy because if you will do this in the traditional way of using the for loop and putting using push method and all that, that will require a lot of lot of code. So here you can do it in a single line. So what I will do is I will again make a variable and I will copy this whole code here. And in, instead of doing the console log, I will say return. And then here you go. As you can see in a single line of function, I have done this. Now I will, what I will do is, I will now do the ES6 fat arrow function use here. And here you go. Still we are getting the same array. So this is how you can create an array out of a new array through map function. This is how you can do the calculations or task with the map function. Another beautiful thing about this map function is instead of writing your own custom code, you can also pass the JavaScript native things. So here you go. I have used the math.square root method and you can see the result is here okay so these are the three use cases which i showed now i will be using the most interesting way when you want to map the values or retrieve the values so for that i will be creating a new array with objects in it so here you go Okay, now again I will make a variable. I will use my array. On that I will use my map function like this. I will uh, use my now I want that the value of each object should come here you go 
so this is how you can retrieve the value from an array of objects this is very simple you can introduce your es6 fat arrow also and it will sort your life so guys this is a short and crisp introduction of map how you can use it and right now you can go back to your old programs you can replace your for loop and wherever you see that you can use the map function and do add some es6 and you are ready with your functional programming okay guys this is all about in today's video if you have any feedback any suggestion anything please mention in the comment section if you like this video give thumbs up share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to this channel